Well, science, technology, engineering, and math together, they're called STEM, and business leaders say that Utah needs more people good at those subjects. Yeah, and they're running a TV ad campaign. You're going to see it here on Channel 2 from time to time. That's to encourage kids to study those subjects. 2 News' Rod Decker went out to a rollout earlier today. Rod, this has some state money behind it, doesn't it? It does. It had $10 million behind STEM last year and another $4.5 million proposed for this year. Besides, there's some private money. Leaders say this will help Utah prosper. You know what you want to be when you grow up? I want to study plants. Grow up. I want to be an animal, like an animal scientist. Kids from Morningside School and Neil Armstrong Elementary emphasize Utah's STEM program. Science, technology, engineering, and math. Can you do algebra? Yes. You can do algebra. Can you do calculus? Okay. These are really good paying jobs. Governor Gary Herbert and business leaders say young people with STEM degrees can find good jobs. So they're urging kids to study STEM subjects. And at Morningside and Neil Armstrong, science and math are emphasized for elementary kids. Are you guys smarter than kids at other schools? Yeah! Okay, you really think so? Yeah! Why do you think you're smarter than kids? We have a magnet program. Okay, now the ads will be running here on Channel 2. Channel 2 and Comcast are proud sponsors of this initiative. You can look at them here, or if you're a kid, maybe you better turn off your TV and do your homework. Back to the studio. Like that advice. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Rod.